their low battery metal fence. Today we've prepared a short video for you looking at the grade of hard rock with the deposits. But first it might be useful just to examine what we actually mean by grade. Grade is the amount of metal contained within a deposit. The higher grade a deposit is, the higher its contained metal content. And the higher its contained metal content, the higher value the deposit is on an in situ basis per ton. Grade is often said to be king. And indeed, it is an important factor to be considered when assessing a project. But other factors are also important, such as recoveries, strip ratios, and geographies. We believe this video can give you the context required to assess and validate what a company is saying. For instance, how many times do you see drill results where the company's management say they're high grade? But are they high grade or are they moderate grade? Is 65 meters at 1.2% lithium oxide high grade or is it moderate grade? Let's get into it. In this chart, we have plotted grade on the y-axis and that's in terms of lithium oxide equivalent. So for companies which report grade as parts per million or lithium carbonate equivalent, we've converted the grade to lithium oxide equivalent. Along the x-axis, we have a list of 33 companies with mineral resource estimates that are compliant to a relevant code. Within these 33 companies, there are around 31 different grades of deposit, which allows us to divide the data set into around three lots of 10-ish different grades. These represent high grade, mid grade, and low grade. Now, if I've missed anyone from this peer group, please let me know. In the chart, low grade is between 1.04% and 0.42%. Mid grade is between 1.34% and 1.06%. And high grade is between 2.4% and 1.37%. And that's on a lithium oxide equivalent basis. So if we consider our fictional drill results of 65 meters at 1.2% lithium oxide, which the fictional management claimed was high grade. In reality, on this chart, we can see this is actually much more mid-grade. And this is one example of how we feel you can use this chart. I hope this video is useful and you enjoyed it. Please like it and share it with your contacts. And let me know in the comments section below if you have any questions or any suggestions. And finally, Thanks very much for watching. You can download all Edison's research for free from our website and you can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter.